another oh, video. I've been having a crazy day, all right? This is the third video of the day. The first two was not my faves. You'll see it in the video. But this one company is definitely one of my favorites because they are really inexpensive, girl. And they from Amazon. So you know what I say, Amazon Prime, get your on time. The Show Hair, 20 inch body wave. I got it in a light brown lace, 13 by six. Uh, I think it's 20 or 22 inches. I can't remember, so I'll definitely link everything below for you guys. I went ahead and put an elastic band in this bad boy. Bleached her, pre-plucked her, all that amazing good stuff. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm just amazing. But anyway, I'm going to show you guys how the wig comes to you guys so you don't be like, why my wig don't look like April's? I mean, like, you can see her scalp. Yes, but trust me, there is some work that's going to have to be done. So let's just get into it. When you receive your package from V-Show Hair, it will come in their black standard box. As I did state, they are available on Amazon, but this particular video will be about their website. You can also catch their coupon codes on their actual vshowhair.com website, which I'll post below, and you can also visit them on Amazon. You'll receive a wig cap in your package. Along with that, you'll also receive one of their signature vshow hair cards. Now this is the unit. She's really pretty. She's 22 inches and she's a Malaysian straight lace front. I do believe the frontal is 13 by four. You can check out the link below. I'll provide all of the information. The ends were really straight on this unit. They were not dead and they were not frayed in any way. As I did state, you can visit them on their actual website where you will find more units that are available along with many different coupon codes and other options. But if you love Amazon just as well as I do, then you can check them out there as well. As you will be able to tell, I will have to bleach the knots. And the lace on this unit looks so light, it just matched my complexion really well. So I do believe that this may be a light brown lace color. Isho Hair does have many different affordable lace front units. So check them out. I'll leave all of their information below and let's get into this video. I already styled the wig before I even did the video because it's just so much easier on a mannequin head. Like I already have thin edges. I'm not trying to burn them off. Plus it makes it so much quicker versus on yourself. So let's just get into it. Girl, I put this thing tight enough so my head could be snatched. You know how like your, your waist be snatched? I'm trying to add a little, you know, slimness to the face. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's get into this, you guys. So as you guys already see, I didn't put this wig on. She is really cute. I'm feeling it. I love V-Show hair. They have very affordable units. So if you guys are on a budget or if you ain't and you just really want to save your money and your coins, then check them out. You can check them out on Amazon. You know I love Amazon, girl. Amazon Prime, get your stuff on time. But you can also check out their actual website, eshowhair.com, where they have much more units to choose from, many more different options, and a whole bunch of different coupon codes. So check them out, check them out. So I'm gonna just take my Dollar Tree hair clips and I'm gonna push my hair back because I really don't want any of the lace to get, well, I don't want any of the hair to get cut off. But you know, I am cutting some of it off, but no big deal. I'm gonna just use my scissors to try to start it off with and then I decided to try these eyebrow trimmers but listen girl this is a little bit complicated got a little bit too complicated for me so yeah your girl went back to her scissors okay the eyebrow trimmer method is cool for those who like it I'm not gonna say I'm a fan I'm not gonna say I dislike it but it does take some getting used to and I'm just gonna continue that same process on the opposite side so I'm thinking that the lace is like a light brown color. It looks very similar, very close to my own. Either way, the lace is meltable, girl. I'm 
music time. Put you on the Prada, send me feeling bad. I've been looking like the nigga that to wish you hard. Then my girls, them are coming, them are looking bad. Man, I'm rolling with my niggas, then we moving mad. So me light on the front, put it up till the morning. On the side, I went ahead and I parted the lace wig above my ear. That is because the wig was a little bit too big, like overlapping my ear. So I just took my rat tail comb and parted it directly above my ear. So that way I can cut off the excess lace. And I'm going to repeat that same process on this side right here, you guys. Take your rat tail comb and part directly above your ear. And just take your small scissors and cut away that excess lace so that way your wig will fit properly above your ear. As you see, my ear is directly, well, directly un underneath the wig now. Prior to that, it was overlapping my ear, which made it very uncomfortable and it would not lay correctly. So now's the time to go ahead and make you some wispy hairs and your sideburn hairs. Now, one of my subscribers in a recent comment did tell me that she wants to do baby hairs, but she feels though that some people would say that she's too old for them. She's about my age. We're not old, honey. There's no such thing as old hairstyles. However, I do know that some hairstyles we just will not wear. So I'm gonna to attempt to just try to make them a little bit more mature woman friendly, as I normally do. So I just took my got to be hairspray and I just sprayed it underneath the lace. Along with that, I'm gonna spray it on top. This will get you a hold for quite a couple of days. But thanks to one of my other subscribers, you guys, I do have a new product, which I will be using in a soon to come video with some different hairspray. This is new to me. I have seen a couple of YouTube um, YouTubers uh, showcasing it on their video channel, on their channel. So I, you know, I have been trying it out. I have it on now, but you guys will see the video soon. So anyway, I'm just gonna continue to spray that hairspray onto my lace. So that way my wig will adhere. You know, find the product that works best for you. I really do like Got To Be Glam Force. I, I prefer it more than the Got To Be Freeze Blast in the yellow can. That hairspray is definitely not my favorite. I've used that about 10 years ago just to hold curls and it didn't. So when I tried to use it with a lace wig, it really didn't work for me. The hold was not really there. This one dries quicker and the hold is a lot stronger to me than the actual freeze blast. But you know, each person has a different opinion and everybody's body temperature is different as well. So we have to keep that as a factor when choosing products for our skin or hair. I'm just gonna take my rat tail comb and just melt that in. And as you see, the wig is laid. And it's a really easy cleanup. All you need is a baby wipe or a cloth. And if you have any extra hairspray in your skin, just wipe it off and then cut those baby hairs, girl. Or wispy hairs. To me, I call them wispy hairs. But you know, you can call them whatever you want. My subscriber, she wanted a more, she wanted to wear uh, baby hairs, but she didn't want to feel as if she was too old for them. We're never too old for certain hairstyles. It's time for a Dee Dee's break, girl. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take my favorite toothbrush in the world for sculpting baby hairs or wispy hairs, and I'm going to make some for more mature women. We don't need a whole bunch of baby hairs. I don't think anybody needs a bunch of baby hairs, but to each his own, you know what I'm saying? So I decided to use the mousse. The hairspray was drying so quick that it would not, you know, sculpt them the way I wanted to. So that was like an angry moment. For me, when I do baby hairs, I don't like to do a lot of them because I just really don't. So I try to avoid them in the front, mostly because I just really don't like baby hairs in the front. So what I do is I take a little bit of my hairspray and I spray in one area and I kind of like swirl the hairs in the front hairline so that way I don't need any baby hairs. If you can see the way I'm brushing the hair, it's almost covering the lace, but not really so. And you may need like one little flyaway wispy hair in the front, but not like a whole head. And this to me is a little bit more natural versus a whole bunch of baby hairs, you know, gel down. Maybe just one or one on the side, which to me is a flyaway. And I don't really gel them down. What I'll do is I'll basically just sculpt the root down. 
I'll kind of like sculpt them if you see me doing right here. And then I'll take some of my hairspray on the back of my comb. Yes, it will stay. And then I'll use it and press it into the root of the baby hairs or the wispy hairs. And that's it. First of all, this was such an easy wig. I love V Show Hair on Amazon. They do have an actual website too, but I love Amazon. You know, with Amazon, you could return stuff, girl, especially if you have Prime. Like, you know what I'm saying? Amazon Prime, you get your stuff on time, girl. Plus, you could return stuff. And I told you guys, I do like to return stuff. But I guarantee you guys, you will not have to return any B Show hair wigs. I think this is like the fourth video that I've done for them. And I'm actually really impressed. They have some really gorgeous units. Super cheap. Why spend all your coins when you could just go to Amazon and get your wig? I mean, some wigs are not going to be like perfect when you get them. So you're going to definitely have to make them your own. But listen, this is one easy vendor that, you know, they have some really nice wigs. So light brown lace looks so good. And like, look. You see what it looked like before, and then I bleached it, and it came out nice. And like one of my subscribers, she did ask me in a comment, because she's like my age, in case you guys don't know, like, you know, I, I got grandkids, so in case you don't know, I'm not going to give you my age, but I'm pretty sure some of you know. She wants to do baby hairs. Some people say it's for the younger generation, and some people say that it's for whoever. Me, personally, I think it's for whoever. Any hairstyle, you know what I'm saying? We can't just say, oh, well, that hairstyle is for the younger generation. Like, I'm saying... I'm not about to go outside with barrettes and bobos in my hair because that I'm definitely not going to do. We already know those are for kids. But I'm like, you know, baby hairs are baby hairs. I don't really like to call them baby hairs because baby hairs are on a baby. I like to call them wispy hairs. So I told her I can do a video tutorial on baby hair slash wispy hairs for the more mature woman who doesn't want a lot of baby hairs. Like, you know, you might see some people just got baby hairs for days. It looked like they got a whole different style. I wanted to give her something that is more mature friendly, more age appropriate friendly, and maybe even more work friendly, whatever, you know what I'm saying? But it's just a way to camouflage the lace on your unit. So all I did, as you guys seen in the video, is just take out a few. I don't tack them down. I just basically tack the root down and then I just kind of like fling the hair. And for the front hairline, so that way I camouflage the lace, all I do is kind of like brush the hair in kind of like a swirl direction. So that way it kind of like goes over the edge of the lace, but you can't really tell. You know what I mean? And then I just leave like a hair like this. This is a baby hair, but not a baby hair. Like it's not stuck down. It just looks like it's a little piece of loose hair. Amazon Prime, girl. Get your stuff on time. What I be telling y'all? I be saving the best for last. Save the best for last. Save the best for last. So, you guys, let me know what you think of this one from B Show Hairs. I will post all of the information below. Stay diva. Hold on. Hold on. Let, me make, let me make sure my hair is straight before I go. I can't leave with my hair being a mess. I love you guys. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe, and share the video. And I will see you guys in the soon to come. Uh, uh,